Mon nom est so Oflipé. And uh, welcome back to some more uh, of the last door uh, that remember, uh, remember, <laughs> it rhymed. Uh, okay, uh, chapter two, by the way. Uh, so we're gonna go through here. Now there are three sides out. Uh, I, I don't know how to pick locks. A large and bright orny key. Well, okay, <laughs> I don't need to pick it. What mystery is lying in <gasps> flashbacks? <laughs> Anthony, don't look into his eyes. Okay, this is not good. Because the deepest darkness dwells in his eyes. Mosigna, come in, my son. Did you think you could hide these books for me? They are just classic liter literature books, father. Socrates and Aristotle. Aristotle. Silence! Instruments of falsehood, you mean? Fallis fallacies coming from the snake. Now, son, get on your knees and raise your arms. <coughs> Apologize to the Lord! <coughs> Pray to the Lord! Ma malum in se? Evil in itself. Okay. Ah! Fucking crows painted doors. A strange AI shaped symbol. Ah! Okay, I, I'm, I'm prepared for this now. Crows? Yeah. Eye of the bur bird. Okay, this. Oh, something about birds. <gasps> it's this dude! Lord, your eyes burn me. I don't deserve mercy nor forgiveness. Oh Lord, have mercy on my soul. Who are you sending me? It's death to whom you are handing me over. Has my hourglass already run out of sand? Father Ernest. Ernest? It's been many years since I lost her that name. Since. Oh, I see. Father, I'm here to be able to remember. You have to help me, I beg you. Please. Entreaties, petitions, praying, torment, exemption. Past times bring us just misfortune and pain. Father Ernest, I was one of your students. Okay, I'm sorry, I had to lower the game volume. I'm sorry, I am sorry, I am sorry. Okay. Uh, one of my old students, you say, it's only the Lord who teaches us. We all must follow his ordinances and disciplines. Get closer, son. Come pray next to me. That does not sound safe. I don't want to pray. The makeshift altar is coated in a dense layer of wax. The candles, having almost burned out, only barely, il barely illuminate something. Creepy image of Christ crucified. Inexplicably, it has a dark cloth covering his head. Do I use this? Play la musica! No, okay, it won't work for him. Hit him in the head. Okay, screw it. Talk to him. He has a large burn covering his eyes. He is completely blind. Despite of his decrepitude, extreme thinness and painless, I can still recognize Father Ernest, but he seems far away, like in another world. The walls are completely covered with cr crosses, a mentally ill act. Uh, can I leave? I can't leave. Um, Father, what do you want me to do? Oh, I get talked to him. Oh, glory be to the Father, and the Son, and to the Holy Spirit. As it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be. Now, my son, tell the Lord which one is his voice. The sharp sword, the wise quill, or the delicate petal? Uh, oh, sh the wise quill? No, no, no! You're enveloped by sin. And now, my son, uh, tell the Lord which one is his holy path. The wise virtue, the endless blame, or the blessed penance. I gotta go with the endless blame. No, I... Oh shit, the crosses are falling down. 
the faceless pilgrim, the gate guard, or the lost seaman. Uh, seaman. <laughs> I am the lost seaman. Yes, yes, that's it, my son. We live lost in an endless ocean of sin and blame. Now leave me alone, I have to purify my soul. I wonder what would have happened if all of the crosses had went down, if I was bad enough. Okay, uh, and then what are we supposed to do now? Okay, so I just went back in. Old razor's blade stained with blood. We can use that to get up the the pss, pss, tapeth. Dear God in heaven, I feel for you. You lighten in my eyes. I will burn them for you. Dear God in heaven, I feel myself in you. Your eyes are in my soul. I will burn it for you. Dear God in heaven, I fear myself in you. Your sword is in my hands, I will burn them for you. Dear God in heaven, I hate myself in you. My blame is in my heart, I will burn myself for you. That's a good rap song, man. Rap song? Rap song. I know you are there, you didn't hear me? Get out of my room. Despite being blind, it preserves good hearing. I must be more careful when moving. <coughs> I have to wait while he coughs. Oh. Oh. I have to be sneaky. Go back and pray, you. Go back and pray. Go back and pray, I tell you. Can't see me. <gasps> I have to sedate him. Do I kill him? Hit him in the head. Using the wooden stump as a handle, I can use this to cut. Cutting tool. Okay, let's leave this place. Blah blah blah. Yeah, 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 yeah. And go and cut down the tapeth there. The Alright, here we are. Let's cut down this. Ah, flashbacks. Flashbacks on the floor. And finally, our expert on philosophy, Jeremiah Devitt, shows up. Where are you, my friend? We will look for you. Well, as I was saying, tonight is the perfect moment for our next meeting. But I suspect that someone outside our group is secretly surveilling us. Who is it, Anthony? My dear friends, it's Professor Glynn. Do you mean Father Ernest? Certainly, no doubt about it. Therefore, deal co dear colleagues, I have decided to change the venue for tonight's meeting. Have you noticed the lounge behind the small door of the dining room? I have leave convenient. To borrow the key for our ne necessities. You already know, at 12 o'clock you'll find that door open and I'll be inside the lounge. That's it, my dearest colleagues. Virete me quisiat. Ah! I remember that in this furniture we used to keep some of our personal belongings. Now it is empty. No crows. The walls are in complete disarray. I could probably punch though though through if I I don't know, though I am tired or something. I remember that this is the bed where I used to sleep when I was a student here. Oh you can sleep, but I'm gonna do that in the next next episode. So yeah, I want to thank you for watching. Gracias por ver. I wish you fun this day, my dudes. And until next time, hasta luego.